here and today I'm going to take you guys with me through my barn night routine slash closing routine. So if you haven't seen my barn morning routine that I did, I will link that up above. Go check that out first. But this is my night routine. Um, earlier today at 3 I brought all the horses in and then at 4 I started feeding them. I didn't feel like I needed to show you guys that since I kind of showed you guys that in my morning routine. But it is now 9.30 at night and I come in and that's when the barn closes. So then I come in, I close the gates and I make sure to do all of the night routine stuff I need to do. So I figured I'd take you guys along with me this time. I brought my doggies. Maddie, doggy come. Come in. Hello. So I'm basically gonna just show you guys what I do when I close up the barn. So let's get started. Okay, so now that Theo's stall is ready, I'm gonna go ahead and bring him in. And there's a couple other horses that are outside that need to come inside as well. So basically, I'm gonna go grab all the horses from outside, bring them into our stall. So I'm not gonna show you all of them, but I'll show you a couple. So let's start off by grabbing Mr. Theo. Water. 
make sure all horses have enough until the morning when they'll get re cleaned out and dumped and then refilled. Some horses are heavier drinkers than others and it's really, really hot today. So we're just gonna check them and I'm just gonna bucket them. I'm not gonna drag the hose out because usually only a couple need to be done every night. So I'm gonna go through and check all the waters in the lower barn and then after that, I'm going to turn off all the lights, shut all the doors that need to be shut, close everything down, down here for the morning, and then I'll go up to the upper barn and do the same thing. So let's go. I think so. Maddie, Maddie. <laughs> I don't know where she th thought she was going. up in the upper barn which means turning off fans turning off lights closing doors that need to be closed stuff like that so these five stalls right here all need to have their fans unplugged because if you can see we've got a hot wire running around the top of our feed stall to keep the raccoons from going over and getting into it so the uh, switch the fuse the, the fuse the switch in the fuse box. That's a fuse, right? Mm. Whatever. The flicky thingy has to stay on for this row so that the hot wire will stay on all night, but the fans need to be unplugged at night. The fire hazard reasons also it's not hot at night, so I'm gonna go unplug them. And I'm short, so I need this thing. So now all the fans are off, all the lights are off, all the doors are shut and latched that need to be latched. Everybody's where they need to be until tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. when morning chores start over again. So then basically I just turn off all the lights in our lounge and bathroom area and turn off the AC and then head out and shut the gate. Okay, got <laughs> Owen wants to do the outro today apparently. Um, I figured I'd have Owen join me for our outro today since you all said you've been missing him in my videos. He's still here. He's not going anywhere. He's just taking it easy. So 
thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed our barn night routine. I apologize for the crappy lighting. It is now a little bit after 10. The barn is ready to be closed. And 10 o'clock at night is pretty dark, especially with barn lighting, it's not so hot. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. And you all very much requested this video after I showed you my morning routine. So here it is, there you guys go. So again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed it. and. We'll catch you on our next video, won't we, Onin? Bye.